evening everybody and welcome to another episode of talk with these i mean it is with daniel yes so today is friday and today is a special day today is ramadan so happy ramadan or ramadan kareem to our muslim friends and family yeah so today being friday we're having our recap session okay and this week was actually quite eventful so i remember i said that i'm going to tell you guys um if anything happened during the from friday to beginning of this week i'm going to actually recap it i'm going to recap it soon so yes things happened so on friday abakairi died so abakairi is the chief of former chief of staff for our president buhari nigeria yeah so he died from coronavirus complications and all and then his burial went on and then actually his death spiked a lot of things because we actually saw the NC, ncdc official that actually disposed his clothes on the floor and also people reacted to that also simi a musician a musician re- released um a singles to the k and from that people realized she was pregnant so we are actually happy for simi congratulations and so on yeah so down to this week started with sunday and Sunday, you know, really much happened. People stayed in their houses, worship in their houses. Yeah, so kudos to those that actually kept the law and didn't actually break it. Okay, so then we moved to Tuesday, Monday, sorry. Quite as eventful. People were just worried because the number of people infected with corona cases were actually increasing. So moving on to Tuesday. On Tuesday, Lagos State hospitals were actually shutting down. St. Nicholas, for example, shut down because their staffs were getting infected. So we are, our prayers are with those that actually got infected during the line. So God would heal them. And we appreciate your efforts. Another news on Tuesday was Choma David Do's fiance test, tested negative. Yeah, so previously Choma was positive for coronavirus, but now she has recovered. So yeah, we're really happy for we are really happy for Chioma and all. Yeah, so another thing that happened on Tuesday was federal government disowned the news that um, schools are going to resume November 2020. So they said there's nothing like that, though they've not released a date for resumption, but definitely not November 2020. Now, moving on to Wednesday. On Wednesday, we saw that um, governors of Nigerian states came together and agreed to increase the interstate lockdown by 14 days. The definition of this was not actually clear to most people and some people were asking if it actually means that there will be no movement from one state to another that means maybe from lagos you can go to Ogo state or to any other state but there will be movements within the state and all but basically they agreed that 14 days is being added to the interstate lockdown and yeah so another thing that happened was Bwari ordered the payment of lecturers under the ipiss scheme immediately on Wednesday so he said they should be paid and actually that's a good thing and I guess the lecturers are going to be happy because they need the money to survive this period so another thing on Wednesday was Wednesday was marked 10 years that Da Green a musician in Nigeria died yeah so Da Green died 10 years ago from a car accident and Wednesday marked his 10 year anniversary so may his soul continue to rest in peace now moving on to Thursday on Thursday um, Buhari was crowned com- um, champion by ECOWAS of COVID-19 yeah so basically that's a good title for our own president first good title that I'm hearing in a very long time right yeah so ECOWAS crowned Buhari um, a champion um south africa also um said they are going to relax their lockdown from ending of april so by may maybe people will start going out we don't really know the definition of things but they said they are going to relax the lockdown and all so the next thing that happened on thursday was that there was a high increase in the number of corona cases currently nigeria is going to be Hitting 1,000 very soon. That's even if we've not hit 1,000 because currently we're at 981 with 197 recovered and 31 deaths. That's actually quite high. And basically, they said the increase is due to local transmission. That means people are still going out within their own vicinity, but they don't know that they are transmitting this virus one way or the other. So please, let us try and stay at home. So basically, this week was very, very eventful. So if anything also comes up, from today to beginning of another week, I will.
it for this week. Thank you all for watching and listening. So thank you for your reviews too. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Please, we need your comments because that's what make me improve and all. So thank you all. I remain Elizabeth Daniel. See you on Tuesday for our discussion session. Yeah, so bye. Have a lovely day.